This is James Holder for IFL TV. I'm in Leeds today, head of the North Power Show. With me, I've got Commonwealth champion Josh Warrington. How are we doing, Josh? I'm very well, thank you. I'm very Good well yourself. Good to, I'm very well, sir. Good very man. well. Good how man. are you feeling at the moment? I'm very well. I'm uh, excited. You know, it's uh, exciting to be fighting in Leeds um, on a massive show. So, yeah, all good. Very, very tough opponent in Martin Lindsay. Very experienced campaigner. Talk to me a little bit about the fight coming up. Martin Lindsay, tough, tough guy. He's, um, he's boxed some tough names and uh, he's beat some good names as well. Um, it feels like I'm going straight into, um, you know, another massive fight at such short notice. But then again, the last fight against one more, though it was a massive fight and whatnot, like one two attacks in. So, you know, I'm ready. I'll be ready for the 21st. Just looking back at the fight against Munro, how would you assess your performance in that fight? Um, there were a few things what I could have done better, but uh, you know we got the result that we wanted to. Um, you know, it's, 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 uh, to get, get a win against someone like Rinder Monroe, it's a, it's a massive win. Um, so I took a lot of confidence from that as well, um, and shown what boxing ability as well as going forward. Getting the win over Rinder Monroe was a massive scalp for yourself. Do you think beating Martin Lindsay will give you a good level of where you're at at the moment? I definitely, I think. Uh, it's, more people will start taking interest in and, and you know and believing at what level we're at you know mm -hmm. last three fights I've boxed uh, I've boxed some you know very good kids and going into this one it's it's another tough opponent but so mm -hmm. I'm, I'm just fighting whoever's been put in front of me. Martin Lindsay's been in with some great people notably Lee Selby yeah do you think a potential fight with yourself and Lee Selby somewhere down the line could, could be on the cards? Oh, I reckon I reckon there'll be talks of that um, you know get through this one well um, I'm not looking past this one I never look past the fight because uh, Obviously, you'd start doing that, you get distracted, so I'm not looking past this one, but, you know, Lee's moving on to uh, World Honours, and, um, you know, I'm still domestic scene, but maybe down the line, I think it possibly won't could happen. Will this be your third fight on the matching promotions? Uh, yeah, third one, third one. How are you yeah. finding it at the moment? Oh, I like it. I mean, uh, I liked it last week. We got uh, some nice treatment. I mean, uh, you know, got signings and that for now. And uh, chauffeur down to the venue and my own change room. I thought, hey, I don't mind this. So it's good that we can continue with that. And uh, yeah, I enjoy, I enjoy it. How, how, how much do you love boxing and how important is it to you that you keep on winning in your career? Oh, I love boxing and, you know, especially fighting at home. I mean, driving. This Leeds Arena, I've watched it being built. I drive past it every day from uh, from work, and uh, you know it's been like a bit of a dream to you know finally get to fight on it. So you know, we've got, just got to keep winning because I want to keep on bringing big nights to, to Leeds and big nights to Arena. How does the transition feel from fighting on small hall shows to then getting a chance to fight on the arena shows? Um, <clears throat> I think in a way it feels a little bit like. A long time coming, you know. I've just, I know I've had to be patient. Um, you know, you see some lads who were coming up for the career, and uh, you know, five, six fights to fighting on these massive shows. But you know, I've been patient, and there's been times when uh, I've boxed on some, you know, Sky undercards, and they've been taking ring down and sweeping up, and I've still, you know, been waiting to go on. But uh, it, it feels good that we're finally here, and I want to keep at this level, so it gives me a little boost to make sure I keep winning. 21st of May at the Sports Direct Arena. Yep. Um, Last chance Sports Direct, said, first Direct. Sorry, first Direct. We're not no Newcastle. Sports Direct. <laughs> we're, not, we're not Newcastle. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, it's my first time in there. No, it's all right, I'll let you so off, I'll let you off. Let the play work for me. Yeah, all right, work with you. You've had a long, long trip um, up here. Last but not least, have you got a message to all your friends and family and fans? Why should you come out and support you come the 21st? I just hope that everyone uh, could come down and make it. And, uh, you know, it's, it's, all them have said, oh, come to your fight. This is an opportunity. It's on the doorstep. Come and see what we're all about. It's going to be a, a, a noisy atmosphere and uh, I hope that everybody can be part of it. Do you get that a lot? People saying, oh, I'll have a ticket, I'll have a ticket, I'll oh, have yeah, a ticket. And then they're hard uh, to track down fight <laughs> week. <laughs> there's um, people in there. There's uh, gunners and doers. You yeah. get, uh, oh, yeah, I'll come to your fight, I'll come to your fight. And then next minute you go looking for them. Oh, I can't come, mate. Um, <laughs> I've had to take Ladybird into uh, into pet into vets or something like that because they've got a broken wing. And you're like, oh, hold on a minute. And then you'll see them out in town a week later with a bottle of empty grey goose living big life. So, yeah. yeah. Does it make you appreciate the people that do come yeah, out? Yeah, definitely. There's, a, there's a lot of people who've, uh, who've been there from start and they keep on supporting me. And um, I just want to say a massive thank you to them people who've been there from start. They know who they are and uh, without their support, you know, it helps me get to where we are today. Right. Well, Josh, thank you for giving me a bit of time today. Thank you very I much. I look forward to catching you again real soon. Thank you yeah. very much. Leads that way. Thank you.